What's Gucci fam today we will be editing a VTuber avatar in Blender and giving it an earring, before we start, let's download all the plugins we need for Blender and Unity, first we need VRM add-on for Blender, the link is in the description, click on code, then download zip. Next up, we need Cat's plugin. It's a useful plugin that helps us set up our avatars properly, the link for this is also in the description. Now we need UniVRM, I am using version 0.79 because some of the newer versions were giving me issues, click on the Unity package file and select open with Unity. Now it will open in Unity and ask you to import files, make sure everything is checked then click import. Now to install the Blender plugins, go to edit, preferences, install, select your cat's zip file then click install add-on, then do the same for the VRM add-on. Now in your preferences, search for VRM and make sure it is enabled, then do the same for cats. Don't forget to save your preferences. Now we can finally begin. Let's import a VRM file. First thing I do is I use Cat's plugin to fix the model. Ah uh, yes, that's more like it, haha. <laughs> okay, I will now model an earring. If you are interested in a basic modeling tutorial, I will have a link for one in the description, I will just make a quick candy cane model for demonstration purposes. Now I will create a basic chain and then join it with the earring. Now I will reset the object's position to 000. In edit mode, I will position the earring accordingly. In edit mode, select all faces with A, then press U and select Smart UV Project. I recommend unwrapping it manually for more accuracy but in this case I am opting for convenience and ease of use. Now I will quickly paint over the earring, if you want a tutorial on painting and unwrapping, I will have a link for it in the description. Don't forget to save your texture. We're now going to create new bones for our earring, this is needed for physics.
we will parent the earring to the armature with armature deform. Now we're going to weight paint it, again, I have a tutorial on all of this linked in the description. There we go, our model is complete, now we just go to CATS plugin and click fix model then export. I imported my model into Unity, click on it, go to model and enable legacy blend shape normals, choose humanoid for rig, I use external materials. Drag your model into the hierarchy, mine is a bit large so I will make it smaller, haha. <laughs> now with the model selected in hierarchy, click on VRM0, then export. Fill in the details and export it wherever you want, we need to import the VRM so I exported it directly into my Unity project folder. A bunch of new files will appear in your project view, find your model's prefab object then drag it into the hierarchy. We can now delete the old model. As you can see we have the bones right here. To give the earring physics, we need to go to the secondary object. We will add the base of our earring bones to root bones. As you can see, it now moves, excellent job. Now let's add a collider to the head so that the earrings don't go through it. Select the head bone, then add a VRM spring bone component. Now go to the secondary object, and add the head bone as a collider group. I will now add a picture for my VTuber. Finally, let's add the blend shapes so that our model can talk, click on your avatar then scroll down to VRM blend shape proxy component then double click the blend shape file to open it. Now just select the blend shapes and assign the correct blend shape to it, you can also add custom blend shapes by clicking on create blend shape. Now select your avatar in the hierarchy, then go to VRM0 and export it wherever you want, that's it, your avatar is complete. Wow, amazing job, can I get your autograph please? Let's go massive poggers yeah boy, if you enjoyed this video please leave a like and tell me what you think in the comments, subscribe for more nonsense, bye bye.